Good Saturday morning to you ladies and gentlemen. This is Rusty78609 from near Lano, Texas on a Saturday morning. Cool 60 degrees here this morning. Feels good. High is supposed to be about 93. And for summer in Texas, I'll take that all day long. And uh, anyway, I'm still alive in my casita, 2019 17 footer, 84 square feet of living space. Long time, full time RVer. Today is the first day of the rest of your life. Make it a good one. It's the day after yesterday, the day before tomorrow. And uh, that's about it. Also, I want to give a shout out to a couple that came by yesterday for a visit. They're from Kansas and they're visiting their family and friends somewhere nearby. And they came by and said hello to me. Thank you very much. Enjoy your trip back to Kansas. We're going back to Kansas, Toto. <laughs> a lot of y'all won't know what that means. Anyway, oh, they're also, the, the, they're pulling the movie Gone with the Wind. I thought I'd give you an update on that. <laughs> it's racist. Ah! <laughs> anyway, uh, what else? Uh, Bangor, hey, Google, what's the temperature in Bangor, Maine? In Bangor right now, it's 54 degrees. With a high of 69. Hey, Google, what's the temperature in Butte, Montana? The current temperature in Butte is 65 degrees. With a high of 77. Hey, Google, what's the temperature in Fairbanks, Alaska? The current temperature in Fairbanks is 56 degrees. With a high of 78. Pretty nice. Anyway, this is Trenton Clump, a grinning it. That's a Tweety Bird. Teddy Bear with my name on it, Popeye and Olive Wolf from the old Popeye cartoons, Betty Boot from the 1930s, Mr. Bill from the 1970s, and back behind them is a sticker with a jalapeno that says Nady Texan. That's a million dollar bill, a thousand yen note, five euro note, two dollar bill, Mr. Bojangles, a banana that's just about gone, two bras that belong to Olive Oil, and a smiling face with nose, ears, and hair that I added. And this is a sticker that says, life is better in a casita. Hey, Google, tell us a joke. Why did the school kids eat their homework? Because their teacher told them it was a piece of cake. Wonderful. <clears throat> now, without further ado, oh, I'll do some videos today. Uh, I did one yesterday evening. I went and got me a pizza. It's a mesquite-fired pizza. They have a mesquite oven and they have this big round pan they put the pizzas on it and push it in there and yeah it's okay i'll talk i'll show it to you this evening <coughs> and let, let you get hungry for a pizza <laughs> anyway dertrixa says omg on golf make your own long putter uh and dan sanborn here's a good start for the morning you know these are the kind of comments that make you feel good all over this is something that really nice. Dan Sanborn says, you are you are an idiot. <laughs> I mean, he's not an idiot. I'm an idiot. I mean, oh, God. Anyway, uh, Dan, hey, Matilda, got, got you a snack coming here. I'm not going to ban him forever. I'll just, I should, because I, I don't like stupid comments like that. But here he comes. It's our, oh, Matilda got it. I hear her out there smacking. She's turned into a dumpster. Actually, she's over here. But anyway, Matilda, maybe some more coming. Hang around, babe. Uh, Tanner on uh, Walkabout says, nice. Stonewall Pizza, that'll be a, a nice step up from the old gas station pizza. Enjoy your Friday treat. Actually, I like the uh, uh, Hunt Brothers Pizza better than any pizza around, actually. Uh, yeah, okay, thank you, Tanner. Uh, this is Rob Towen on the long putter, make it myself. I just threw that video in for a little flavor. <laughs> but I did make it. I did. I, I use it. Hey, Rusty, I sure hope you got permission from the Park Coast at your new RV park before you decided to make yourself at home. I don't know what that means. From the park, I'm, I'm paying rent. And that you also alerted him that your old neighbors would be dropping by on occasion. You know, the cattle, deer, donkeys, and dogs. Yeah, I wish they would. Well, actually, there are donkeys around here somewhere. I hear them. And uh, deer, there's deer all around here. You see deer tracks all the time. I haven't seen any 
Uh, I've seen some in the distance, but they're here, yeah. And dogs, yeah, there's there's no everything. Everything's here. Thank you, Rob Talon. This is Franny Lee 38. Loved it. That's on the Kasori electric kettle. Yeah, that, that thing's quick, man. <clears throat> here it is right here. Right there. Good thing. I, I, I filled it up. It'll hold uh, 1.7 liters max. But no, it's it's a cooking machine, man. or excuse me, a boiling water machine. It's got a little thing that fits under it, and you just set it down on, and it, it'll automatically cut off uh, when the water boils. It's called a Kosori kettle, C-O-S-O-R-I kettle. Anyway, La Patri, pa Patri, La Patri, I guess. Uh, trike man sets speed record <laughs> out of my driveway. Uh, this is what we have to look forward to at 70. Yeah, I guess so. I was 74 when I did that, I think. Will Hunt, uh, on my making a long putter, you, oh, here it will. He says, you cannot use that. That, my friend, is a pure genius work of art. Yeah, I hear you. I ought to hang it on the front of my RV. Yep. I have these, well, you know, you give me time to think, and I, and I can, you know. Nana Betty G, good way to keep heat out of out of your trailer. Oh, that's the Kosori uh, electric kettle. Yeah, it, it, it boils water quick. Yeah, it, it doesn't do much. Yeah, that's a good, it, it would work. You, you couldn't, I don't think you could do it. You could do it, well, you might be able to do it boondocking if you got a large enough inverter. It draws 1,500 watts. I mean, it's a, it's a, it's pulling some juice. Sammy G. Uh, that golf stick is a work. Oh, I already read that. Oh, wait a minute. That's that golf stick is a work of art. Are you going to do a video on how to convert your trike into a golf cart? No, I'm not going to convert it into a golf cart. I tried carrying my clubs a couple of times down to the clubhouse, and uh, I, I don't even like to do that. It's too awkward. So I'm just going to use the trike for the trike, and I'll drive down there in my truck, even though it's only about a quarter mile. <clears throat> I could walk down there carrying my clubs, but I'd rather not because when I get through, <clears throat> sometimes I'm a little tired and I don't want to pack them back up here. Scotty Thompson, cool video tech talk. I says, I bet you are okay at golf, Rusty. I'm okay. You're right. I'm okay. That's about it. Uh, Got to sneeze. Sneeze done. Uh, Scotty Thompson, bowling is back on TV. PBA, professional bowling on Fox. Fun watching all the good bowlers on TV. Way to go, Scotty. Watch that of that stuff if you choose to. Ken Gardner, Gardner on the putter. It is still legal to use the long putter <clears throat> as long as it touches only your hands and, not, and does not rest against your body. Bernard Longer still uses a long putter on the Champions Tour. It was very controversial when they made the rule change. I ain't worried about any golf rules at all. I mean, I know some people are. I'm not. I don't care. I'm out there to just hit that. I just want to hit that ball as far as I can and then go see if I can find it. Uh, Scotty Thompson, uh, cool comment call, Rusty. Thank you. William Bingham. <clears throat> On the putter, got a lot of comments on that stupid putter, man. Uh, well, it's not a stupid putter. It's actually a smart putter. I, I mean, uh, you know what I mean. Uh, William Bingham, Rusty, you want to know why the guys at the golf course changed tee times and didn't tell you? <laughs> Trike man has become the putter man. They couldn't keep up. The other Mr. Bill. Yeah, I'm sure a lot of things I did just didn't didn't go with. Because, you know, one guy said, did you see the whatever on TV the other day? I said, man, I don't even have a TV. Well, you got to know that went over well. <laughs> yeah, he didn't know what to say. You don't have it. You know, his, I know his, he wanted to say, you don't have a TV. Anyway, but he didn't. Uh, Comal Cat, okay. Yep. Uh, Raccoon Little Bear on the putter says, wait, what? I saw those pet rocks on the left and old Thorny on the right smiling the best a cactus can. Then I realized that this old, this is older footage. He, he, yeah, I did that at my old home base. And I just remembered it yesterday. And I thought, hell, I'll post it. Why not? Uh, Cher, Leo, Cher Leo, Reinhardt? I guess. I don't know. She left three somethings. <clears throat> Judy Brewer. Hello, Judy Brewer. Like the teapot, especially the blue light. Yeah, it's actually pretty to, to watch. I turn the lights off when I put the hot water on. Because it's got that blue light at the bottom. And when the water starts boiling, it kind of gives a weird effect. It's neat. Anyway. I know, I know, I know. Back on the meds. <clears throat> anyway, Annie, or excuse me, Allie, trailer. I think you could boil eggs in the kettle. You could. 
Well, I don't know if you could or not, because what happens when, it, when the water starts boiling, it cuts off. I guess you could cut it back on. I don't know. But no, I just use it to boil the water for my breakfast and my tea. Uh, Eric Younghands, you're braver than I am. I have, I have a stainless st uh, kettle for my trailer. A glass one would just create one more layer of anxiety. Sure is pretty. Yeah, it is. The reason I got this instead of the stainless steel is uh, this way I can see when I need to clean it. And they've got a, a recommendation with the instructions that came with it. If you put vinegar and a little water in there and then boil it, I think, and then, and then let it sit, and then they say you can just wipe out that calcium deposit. We'll see. <clears throat> Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, he says, Val here on the kettle says, your giggle and excitement for this kettle made me laugh. You're too cute. I love your daily videos. Well, I'm glad you do, Val. I'm glad somebody does. And not many of you, I know that. <laughs> Mandolins and radios. You know you're from Wyoming when you hear BLM shout it and wonder what is going on with the Bureau of Land Management. <laughs> yeah, not many people even know what BLM stands for. Mike Fortune. Hey, Rusty, it's beautiful and love. It's beautiful, and it's a lovely bridge. Good luck and be safe. Yeah, you know, I can trike across that bridge. I may do that, do a video, because they got a little walkway that's wide enough for the trike on each side of the bridge. So I'm gonna, I might trike across the bridge one day and do a video showing, showing trike man triking the bridge. Uh, this is Red Star 46. He says, yay, way to go, Rusty. Oh, this is a political thing. Anyway, all right, yeah, thank you. <clears throat> Dorinda Christian on the golf on the putter it says problem, plan, solution. I like the way you think, Rusty. You would always be welcome on my team. Yep, improvise, men, improvise. When it, you don't have whatever you need, improvise. Because, sorry, this is electric kettle, Tommy Devers. I have an electric kettle, but I like this one much better. I love that you can see through it. Guess I'll be using the link and buying a new one. Thanks for the review. Well, you're quite welcome, uh, Tommy. It, it works. I mean, it, it, it boils water quick. No kidding. I mean, not that I care. I'm not certainly not in a hurry. <clears throat> but, yeah, it's interesting. This is on the tiny, this is on the cabin. Bonita, nope, sorry, I'm more of a cottage tiny house lady myself. Well, excuse me, Bonita, I didn't know. My 23-foot RV looks like a gypsy RV colors galore yeah well good for you beneath it's yours do what you want to oddball now that fits here i guarantee you i like using a bat works fine on the golf course yeah i've heard people talk about that uh dennis 78382 necessity is the mother of invention plato get her done larry the cable guy thank you dennis 78382 dennis also has a youtube channel check it out he lives in the Corpus Christi, Texas area, and um, lives in a pickup with a camper top. Neat guy. Dennis also drives for Uber and Lyft in that area. But anyway, this is Pack and Scouter on the kettle. Love mine. Clean hard water buildup with cream of tartar and a full part, pot and boil. Well, I might do that. I'm, I'm not sure. When it gets ready, I'll check it out. Thank you. This is... Fat Man TV One. Okay, a catchy name. Are you still keeping place in New Mexico? No, no, it's sold. Shift into high on the putter. It says I'm thinking duct tape. No, it worked like it is. I mean, it, it's uh, it's fine. I, 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 I didn't glue anything or anything. It just all stuck together and it works. Uh, this is a kettle. J Joy Seven appears to be very efficient. It is, but remember, it draws 1,500 watts. So you guys that are out camping and using solar uh there went a day's worth of sun i mean uh j joy seven again acetone would probably remove the lettering on the pvc pipe unless you prefer to leave their brand on there i'd remove it and put rusty on there no i'm gonna leave it just like it is i mean and in fact the first time i used it well, a couple of guys you, you mean that's pvc well yeah here you can look anyway so you you, you see why i got kicked off the gang why the gang kicked me out well, I really wasn't trying to fit in, to be quite frank with you. <clears throat> William, yeah, I ride down to the golf course, I mean, ride down to the clubhouse on a three-wheel electric cart, which most of it never seen, with a putter I had made, and I don't have a TV, and I'm certainly not politically correct. But anyway, William Francis, how many watts does it draw? 1,500. Not for off-grid, right? No. I doubt it. 
Holly Hackett comment called, wondering about your pillow, that one's that the one that's a wedge. Where did you get it, and does it help? I'm assuming it does. Thanks, Holly from PA. Uh, well, the reason I got the wedge right here, this wedge thing, is because I read in bed, and it, and it makes a nice area to sit. Do I sleep on it too? Yeah, I don't move it. It just sits there. It, but I got it for the reading reason, and as far as acid reflux and all that, I don't suffer from that at all. But it is comfortable, so I use it. It's just like having two pillows. It's only about, it's about this thick, like that, you know, at the top, and then it tapers down. <clears throat> but anyway, I got it on Amazon. If I think about it, I'll leave you a link. But yeah, use my link. Go to Amazon. <clears throat> check out for pillow wedges or something. Uh, thank you, Holly. Mark Reynolds. That's on the electric kettle. That's pretty neat. It is pretty neat. I can't believe I found it by, I found it by looking. Here's three in a row on the putter. R.C. Darcy, drive for show and putt for dough. That's correct. Nice putter stick. Anyway, thank you, Archie. T.G.I.F. Good grief, Rusty. You got some friggin' happy birds singing in the background. Yeah, you got a lot of birds here, just like at the other place I had near here. Johnny Petraglia, three shows a day, seven days a week. Welcome to Rusty's World. Well, you know, hey, man, I ain't got nothing else to do. You know, and I don't edit. I mean, I don't spend a whole week editing and putting in music and stuff. I don't care about all that crap. I mean, I just do the videos. You know, if I see a bug, I was going to do one yesterday on some squirrels when I was walking. There were two squirrels that were having a little debate running up and down a tree. And uh, I thought, if, if I'd had my camera ready sooner, I could have got the got a video out of that that was pretty good and then i saw two a mockingbird and a little blackbird and the mockingbird was trying to run the blackbird out of its territory and it'd fly down and hit peck him on the back <laughs> that's crazy man life there's a lot of entertainment out here i know back on the meds i got you got you <clears throat> sheila bundren wow that was fast very impressive where did you get it thanks for sharing that's faster than my microwave uh well i don't know about that but it's, it, it's it, it go to you just use the link. I mean, I got there's a link in the description of the video, Sheila. Uh, go to and, and go to Amazon using that link, and you got it. Edward Galloway on the putter, great idea, Rusty. Thank you. I thought so too. It saved me some money because I already had a putter. I just had to make it longer. You know what I mean? Uh, S. Lee, aha moment. Maybe this homemade putter is why the other golfers changed the time on you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it had something to do with it. Uh, some people would not understand our mindset of being frugal. Being retired means saving what we can and living simply, at least for me. Actually, I just enjoy life. Hell, if somebody else is not having a good time, I'm sorry for them. You know, like that guy that told me I was an idiot. Well, I am. I'm a good idiot, though. I mean, I'm a damn good idiot. I mean... Uh, this is Diana. You make me laugh so hard sometimes. Well, good. I hope I make everybody laugh because when the world's laughing, that's good. Uh, Carol Erickson, your putting was good before. I'm going to be waiting for a cr critique following 18 holes. Actually, the putter works fine. I used it uh, one. I've only used it one round, uh, but yeah, it worked fine. It's easy to line up and putt, and and you don't uh, uh, you can't get the yips. You know what I mean? The, where you kind of jerk the putter. You know what I mean? And uh, yeah, it's a, but and, and oh, you know one of the things old timers have a hard time doing is, you know, keeping steady and stuff. So anyway, and, I, and I'm certainly not a young timer. Im, Im, immersion, Earl, immersion Earl, immersion Earl, person's name, Kettle Envy, Rusty. <laughs> you got Kettle Envy? Yeah, I hear you. This is Johnny Petraglia. It says, what are they going to think of next? I I don't know. I I didn't know that was out there. I was looking for a. Uh, a coffee pot, just an old coffee pot to put on the burner, and I saw that electric kettle, and I thought, well, hell yeah, since, you know, they pay the electric, or the electric's included in your rent, so I thought, well, rather than using my propane, which I don't use much of anyway, uh, I'd use that, and, okay, anyway, we'll do a few more, oh, I've got to look, shut it down, guys, two more, Bubba Fringman, now that you've sold your home bases, why not get one of these, tiny hills, I've looked at them, but not right now, maybe later, uh, Ron Bailey, $50, $50 Canadian. Ouch. So it is that much Canadian. Well, it's 35 U.S. Anyway, guys. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do today for videos. I got a triking video I may put up. Uh, and uh, who knows. Uh, oh, I got the pizza video for this evening. I might do a beer. I, I got all kind of ideas. But they're, they're not going to be, you know, they're not going to be deep thinkering videos. You know what I mean? But anyway, 
Having said that, thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye bye, buy anything you want, anytime. But if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all of my videos. Why? Well, because it doesn't cost you a penny for one thing. You just click on the link, go to Amazon, buy whatever you want. And then what else? Drink plenty of water, three or four quarts a day won't hurt you. It's good for you. It'll help you avoid gout. It'll help you avoid gout. Kidney stones also help you lose weight because you'll be full of water. <clears throat> and you won't want to eat so much. Only way to really lose weight is what? Eat less. That's it. And then what else? Take deep breaths. Breathe in deeply through your nose and your mouth. Just take a good deep breath. A good deep breath. You know, just really stretch those lungs. You know what I mean? Just fill them up. And uh, then breathe out slowly. Why? Because that relieves stress. Relieving stress lowers your blood pressure. Is that good for you? You got no ideas, guys. You got no ideas. And then stretch, stretch, stretch. Swivel, swivel, swivel. Walk, walk, walk. Pedal, pedal, pedal. Exercise your body once or twice a day. Why? Because it's good for you. You'll feel better immediately. And you may live healthier a little longer. Then what else? Stand guard at the door of your mind. Do not let negative Nancy or negative Ned get inside of your head. This is your head, your frontal lobes, your consciousness. Those little neurons up in there forming neural links with making your thoughts you, basically. Add good ingredients. Do not watch the news. Do not read the newspaper. Unless you want to do the crossword puzzle, fine. Or the cartoons, fine. <clears throat> anyway, enjoy your life one day at a time. Thumbs up, carpe diem. Oh, what am I doing here? Oh, accentu accentuate the positive, eliminate the negative, and enjoy your life one day or one moment at a time, and uh, make today a good one. You know what I mean? And so, adios, bye-bye, hasta luego, vaya con Dios, aloha, and all that stuff. And we'll talk again later. What about? I don't know. I mean, if I, The tracking video I did, is, I think I've already done one like it. But anyway, adios, amigos, bye-bye.